Hello guys, in this video I will show you why you must select the right data type for your data inside database for storing the right values. For example, here I saw many of developers use this string value or varchar for storing numbers or any value actually like dates or numbers or, or anything more than string. But it's wrong because I will show you why. As you can see here, I made something like that. Here this orders column stores the orders number or orders account of users and I saved it as a string, right? And it's wrong and I will show you why. Here in my database, I stored some values here, 10, 12, 18, 30, and 28. And here in my controller, I created this endpoint, which filter users by order count. And also I created this scope inside my user model here, scope or the model takes minimum, minimum value and the maximum value and getting the orders between these two values right and now here in my endpoint my controller again here my postman i am querying user using this endpoint here get all users who has orders between 10 and 20 right here i will send a request if you notice here it works fine i will select also only id and orders right also don't forget here in our database this order column stored as bar char or string right so back again here in my endpoint and i want to get users who has orders between 10 and 20 send request and now it works fine orders number 10 12 and 18 back to our database again here's 10 12 and 18 and this value between 10 and 20 right but what if we do something like that imagine we have now amount big amount here 10,000 or thousand here 1,200 and so on right save now the minimum value is 1,000 and the maximum is 3,000 back to our endpoint again and I want to execute the same query. It must return null because the minimum value is 10 and the maximum value is 20, which is out of range. Send request again and it returns non logical value, as you can see here, right? The reason behind that here, if we die and dump our minimum and maximum values here, minimum and max, and send request again, it returns as string right and also the query are executes like that here in our table plus select all or id and orders from users where orders between 10 and 20 right it works also with error like that as you can see here because the value is a string but if i remove it here 10 and 20 as integers and execute again it works correctly now here is the reason you must select the right value so now you have a solution if you want to keep it very char or as a string you can do something like that here inside your scope back to our scope again and I will say here, set it as integer. And also this is as integer, right? And now I will show you again here, it now string, but inside the scope, if we back again, if we die and dump minimum and maximum and refresh, now this convert to number or numerical value. Now execute the query again, and it works correctly return is nothing right or even if you don't convert it to integer or numerical value and if we change our column type here from varchar to integer for example this one integer right and save now it's integer back to our endpoint again without converting them to integer or anything keeping them as string right back and run again it works correctly even if we execute the same query with strings 
right here and execute it works correctly again now let's run it for example getting orders between 1000 and 2000 send request and now here 1000 and 1200 and other value right back to make sure it works correctly from our database here 1000 and this one and this one here then starts from 2800 and then 3000 here is a quick tip why you must select the right data type for your data if you found it useful support me by clicking on like share and subscribe see you in next videos